You're watching Impulse on the Freedom Network. Freedom! You thought it was going to be Anthony this time. Well, guess what? It's Cousin here to do a review. I'm here to do the review on the Zora 2 headset made by Noontech. All right, guys, here's the beautiful packaging. I uh, typically probably wouldn't do this because uh, usually the, the products I do get are usually in brown boxes, but I figured the way they shipped it, and I have a table for this, uh, you know, why not go ahead and show off this product uh, in the original box? Um, I did test it out a little bit. The couple things about this headset I did notice. First off, this is supposed to be a high def headset. Um, I did test it out on a couple games on Skype and a couple of the programs. Uh, one thing I did notice so is first off, the earpieces are super, super small. So after about 10 minutes, it really started to hurt my ears. Uh, the nice part about this though is it's a nice hard plastic and it is a soft cushion up top here whenever you put it on top of your head. Uh, it does fold up, somewhat compact, it's decent enough to probably pack it away if you want to take it somewhere. Now this does come with a plug-in cable, uh, which also makes it a hands-free cable uh, for the headset because there is a button right here on this you can use. As far as the sound quality goes, I'd say I'd probably give it a 7 out of 10. Um, it does sound pretty clear. The only thing I didn't like about it though is there's not a lot of bass to it. So if you're playing uh, maybe a video game for instance, um, some of these games are kind of give a little bit of a deep bass sound to them. It doesn't quite produce that type of sound, but it is pretty clear so you can hear a nice crisp sound whenever you do use this headset. This also is adjustable too, so whether you're a kid you can keep it in this position. Uh, if you're an adult you actually can open it up or maybe if you wear a hat like I do sometimes. This will give a little bit more room on your head. This also comes in four different colors. And this headset also produces surround sound. So again, the quality is pretty good. Uh, the only thing I didn't like about it, again, it doesn't have quite the bass I'm looking for whenever I'm playing uh, like a shooter of some sort, like a Call of Duty uh, or a Counter-Strike type game. So overall, I'd probably say I'd give this, this headset probably a 7 out of 10. Uh, reason being is first off, for myself, for my uh, comfortability. I like to have the earpiece over my ear. Unfortunately, this does not do that. I know some people do like headsets like that, but I'm not the type of person. I'd rather have it over the top of my head overall. I do like the durability to it. It is hard plastic. Um, there is some reinforced steel inside here too. That way, the chance of you breaking is going to be pretty slim. It is adjustable, like I said before. But most likely, you probably wouldn't use this headset for gaming. Again, probably listen to music. Uh, maybe when you're doing editing on your videos. This is probably the headset that I would recommend. Probably not for gaming overall. Now I did look online for the price of this headset and Amazon right now has it for around $60 which isn't too too bad. Um, it's not a high-end uh, headset and it's also not a cheap headset either. So in the comments below let me know if this is a headset you think you may use. So again I'm Larry aka Cousin, Senior Marketing Manager for Freedom. Like, subscribe, comments please. Nah, that's not my line. So give us a thumbs up if you think this is a headset you would use. Down below, write in the comments the headset that you do use, and to make sure you hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you in the next review. Of your chest, and it sits up tight here. So a lot of people are like, kind of like want to put it down here. That's not where it should be. It actually should be up here. So I'll go ahead and put this on and show you how this works. Your secrets, if you really look at yourself, you will be speechless. What happened to being doctors and teachers? What happened to being your brother's keeper? Nowadays, kids more worried about.